Proclamation City of Owensboro, whereas millions of adult children face the daily challenge of living with a stutterer, and whereas despite decades of research, there are no clear-cut answers to questions about the cause of stuttering. But we have learned much about factors that contribute to its development in areas of genetics, neurophysiology, child development, and family dynamics. And whereas today, these adults and children uh, can find through the combined efforts of speech language professionals and consumer support organizations, and whereas people who stutter are as intelligent and well-adjusted as non-stutterers, but are often self-conscious about their stuttering and often uh, let the disability determine the vocation they choose. And whereas people who stutter should be treated the same as those who speak fluently in the home, in school, at work, and in the community. Now, therefore, I, Ron Payne, Mayor of the City of Owensboro, Kentucky, do hereby proclaim May 11th through May 17th as Stuttering Awareness Week in Owensboro and age, uh, urge all citizens to join with me in recognition and promotion of stuttering awareness for all citizens. Signed and sealed this 13th day of May 2014, Ron Payne. Again, Nick, one more time. Thank you. And uh, here's this uh, proclamation uh, designating this week as Stuttering Awareness Week. And again, I want to thank you, young man, for bringing this to our attention and taking the effort to do this and making everyone aware of this issue. Again, thanks a lot. And that's thank you. yours. Okay? Well, it all started uh, when. when Ms. Castro asked me to do, I, I, when Ms. Castro asked me to speak to oh, one of my classes about, about, about my speech, um, and I wasn't too fond of the idea, but as I thought about it, I would, um, I, I really wanted people to know about it, and I looked into when was National Stuttering Awareness Week, and I found out, and I figured, why just tell one class when I could have a bigger audience, you know what I mean, have more people aware of aware of stuttering, uh, because a lot of people don't, don't know how to react um, or, or, or really understand what it is. Um, and I know a lot of people get like really awkward when speaking to a stutterer because they don't know what to do. Um, I mean, the best thing to do is just wait and listen, be patient, you know. Um, and uh, um, and originally, I just wanted to get an assembly, you know, in the school. Uh, but she had this idea, and I, uh, and of course, I went along with it, you know. Uh, I, I was really excited for this, and I'm glad it all went down. I was, I was uh, excited. I wasn't, I wasn't sure. It, I wasn't sure if he would actually do it or not. Uh, you know, and I, I didn't even know um, it, if he would see the message. You know, uh, uh, if it would ever get to him, even. Um, and so when I found out that this was actually going to happen. It was, I was really surreal to me. A lot of people don't really focus on stuttering as much. You know, it's just like, like, like I believe we have two, maybe three stutterers in Owensboro High School, um, and so people, and so people, I don't really pay attention to it as much. Um, and I feel like after today. Um, I and mean, really after the talent show, what I did, I feel like a lot of people are more aware of stuttering. Um, a lot of that is to prove that even though I do have my speech impediment, I won't let it stop me from doing things I want to do. Um, um, I do get setbacks sometimes, but it seems like anytime I have an audience, uh, everything's okay. You know, like I'm really fluent with an audience for some reason. Um, but it's mainly for younger stutters to see that that they don't have to be quiet all their life. You know, like I, 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 I never really spoke a lot until I got into high school and I started to get comfortable. 
and I realized my talent too at that. Um, I didn't. I, I, I honestly thought that that I would never really amount to anything because of my speech, but. I've done so much, especially this year. I've gotten into a lot of things. I was even in broadcasting for a little bit. Um, I mean, it's just to prove that y that you can't let a disability be your excuse to, to not do what you want to do.